dirty old white squirrel. I seen a really nice white white one. And that one's kind of a kind of a blondie. Yeah. White that one was kind of a dirty white. He's gone well, now. Yeah. So we are back. I am currently on my way over to Scott's place. He uh, he ordered an E85 ethanol tester off of Amazon, and we're gonna try it out. I've got some uh, X85 from VP, so we're gonna try that out first and kind of see if it is actually 85%. And then we're gonna move over to the stuff that we got from the pump last weekend in Michigan. Um, I'm kind of curious to see, honestly, I think I'm more curious to see if the X85 is actually 85. And uh, since the, it says right on the pump actually, when you when you buy the the um, the pump E85 that it may only be up to 51%. And I've heard it's worse in the winter, so I'm curious as to how good it actually is. As long as it's over 60%, it should be fine for us. That being said, we may have to kind of top it up with like some VP stuff that we know for sure is over the 60% mark. So we'll see about that anyways. And uh, yeah, check it out. I come bearing gifts. Hey. Okay, it's heavy. It's heavy. We're gonna weigh his old gray car. Oh, okay. How much did the other one weigh? Weigh three thousand pounds without him in it. Yeah. That's pretty late. For all steel, it's not too bad. For three thousand and twenty-two pounds or something like that. Wow. Well, yeah, three, three. 3,227 with me in it, so. That's pretty late. Yeah, not too shab. You wanna test some pumpy 85 today? Sure, yeah, yeah we got this here. So what does the instructions say? You have to mix it with water, don't yeah, you? Yeah, you gotta fill it so far with water to here, and then basically the rest with E85, and that'll tell you your percentage. Do you shake it or anything? Yeah. Okay. Yep. Do you have water? somewhere we oh. can find water okay so i know it's the lid it's kind of small um probably best to like pour pour like the e85 into like a small like bottle or something and dump it in there well i actually bought it i i grabbed a syringe from oh, okay yeah that so, works i mean yep. we could try that too so yep. cool well cool. let's see what's uh what it's all about yeah step one remove the cap and fill it with water until the water fill line okay that's easy Step two, carefully fill the gasoline, fill with gasoline, to the gasoline fill line. Okay. Uh, put the cap, or put on the cap, shake well, and let the tester sit upright. Wait for all the liquids to separate and read the results. I don't want to redo that again. Because he's dragging the floor, floor jack. jack through yeah, the back. No, right? I'm sure it'll be fine. <laughs> Thanks, Tim. Okay, well, I guess let's do this. That's correct. Just for ease of getting it from one container to another. Fill it right up so you don't have to shove the syringe down so far. So we're going to start by adding the water and then uh, we're going to go to the E85 and see how it tests out and then we're going to try to pump stuff. All right, now the fuel part. Oh. 
It's clear. Ish. Yeah. Doesn't really say how long we have to wait. No. Actually, shake it up. So we really don't know how long it's gonna have to wait. So we're gonna film a little time lapse here, and uh, yeah, and we'll see how long it it takes. Um, I'm gonna obviously speed it up so you guys can actually watch it happen. But uh, yeah, I can't really imagine doing this at a gas pump though, like. You go to the gas pump, oh. pump, like, I don't know how you get a little bit into there to see what you're going to get. You're basically going to get what you're going to get anyways. Yeah. Um, but it is kind of cool to know what you're working with. It should be strong. It's well, yeah. It should be eighty-five percent, right? It's starting to separate, anyways. I think that's pretty much what we're gonna get for separation. I figured it'd be more of like a yellow color, but obviously it's not. This stuff's probably, oh, it, probably notice more of that stuff. Okay. Yeah, like this is a pretty, pretty pure fuel, or it should be for what you. Yeah, pay it's for. gonna it's gonna be right on E eighty-five. So you get what you pay for with that. For yeah. Sure. Yeah, I'd say that's. Pretty well bang on. Wow. The longer it sits, the more it kind of, it it's more defined the longer it's sitting, so. But yeah, I'd say that's, uh, that's as E85 as you're gonna get. So, the VP stuff checks out. Yep. Time to try the pump stuff and see what it's. Try this, so they're test the uh, Michigan E85. See what Speedway. It, yeah. What do you think? What's your prediction? I bet you like E60. Think 60? Yeah. I bet you 71. Okay. All right, we'll see. It's pretty smelly, but yeah. I don't know. It smells very alcohol-ish. Yeah. yeah. But. All right, so I guess dump that in the toilet, and uh, we'll try the E85. Okay. Or the, well, the pump E85. It is. bubblies and uh i'd imagine it'll come down to the bottom of those bubbles but yeah it keeps getting lower what the hell yeah if i'm right i'm gonna kiss you on the mouth what is that now like e71 what i say e i think you said e70 didn't you something like that yeah it's a little over e70 it's still kind of doing its thing, but yeah. I figured it'd be less just because it's winter time. But yeah, that's like E seventy one, seventy one, seventy two, or no, 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 because it's seventy. It's at seventy five. It's at the seventy five mark. Yeah. So it's like E seventy six. Okay. Well, that's not that bad. Wrong, then. Yeah, but I mean, a good way, I guess. Yeah, it's over sixty, so it's it's good stuff. Yeah, well, I'll dump it in the tank of this, no problem. For sure. Well, there you have it, guys. So, uh, pump E, not as good as VPE, obviously. Well, you would think, anyways. And, uh, but it's still, like, 
E76 from where we got it. It may differ depending yeah. on where you're at, but that was, uh, that was in February too. So. Yeah, so I don't know. Like people say that winter E is no good, but that proves otherwise. It must not be that bad. And uh, yeah, for it being over 60%, it'll work for uh, for what we're doing, anyways. And we won't have to won't have to top it up with the VP stuff. Mm -hmm.